Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a little bit of a different video to share with you. Today's video is going to be a haul, but it is a home decor haul, specifically Christmas decorations. I'm so excited, you guys, because I've told you so many times already, I am so ready for Christmas. Like, I am excited for Christmas this year. So I've been kind of gathering a few little goodies, like Christmas decorations over the last few months, and I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys. So I don't know if, about you guys, but I love watching home decor videos. I'm not that good at home decor. Part of the problem is I'm kind of cheap. Now, when it comes to makeup, I can spend money. You guys know that. I spend a lot of money on makeup. But when it comes to like clothing and home decor, I'm kind of cheap. So I either wait for things to go like really on sale or I just don't buy things, even though like I might need to replace something that's getting old, like stockings or something like that. I'll just hang on to it because I don't want to spend the money. So I'm kind of cheap about it, but I'm trying to get I'm trying to balance things out a little bit and spend a little less money on makeup and maybe invest a little bit more on like home decor and things like that because I'd like my home to feel a little bit more fancy. But I wanted to tell you guys, I have been watching. You guys know I love like talking about other YouTubers and making sure you guys know who I like watching. And anytime I have like a video idea that I get from someone else, I always try to credit that person. So I wanted to tell you who, who I've been loving for home decor videos. Actually, I'm gonna insert a picture of her too and I'll put her channel down below. Her name is Christy Mel. So check out her channel if you like home decor, if you're wanting some really good inspiration. I love her style because she's very like, glitz and glamour and silver and metallic and uh, like glittery and uh, my husband I don't think he would like me to go all the way glam like she does I think he'd be like this is too girly but I love it it's definitely my style and I've been trying to incorporate a little bit more of that kind of stuff into my home decor style as well so make sure you check out her channel tell her I sent you to that would be kind of fun because we're in different genres in YouTube and sometimes people from different genres don't really know about other people's channels so it would be interesting yeah, just let her know I sent you. By the way, real quick, one more thing, as long as I'm just rambling for 20 minutes. Um, if my makeup looks a little weird today, I was trying a halo eye. I don't know how well it turned out. And then also, I think my foundation is oxidizing, which is always annoying, but let's see what I picked up. Okay, so the first couple things that I picked up, I actually got from JCPenney right before I left. I had a uh, couple of my like rewards that I needed to redeem for. So um, I basically got these for free with rewards. The first thing is this cute little tree and it's got kind of, <laughs> I'm really bad at describing home decor, you guys. Like I don't know all of the, um, the I don't know how to describe things too well, but I think this is, what would you call this frosted? I don't know. It's glass. It's very, very fragile. So you do have to be careful with it. Um, but it is from the brand North Pole Trading Company. Um, I think it's a JCPenney exclusive brand. Retail price was $40. But like I said, with my discount and a coupon that I had and my rebate, or not rebate, rewards, I ended up getting this for like $2. So it was basically free, which is great. So um, I think I'm going to probably put this um, on, on top of my fireplace I have this like really large flat area that needs to be filled in because it's like a corner fireplace it's really annoying um, but I think this would be really pretty up there and then because I had one other rebate and I wasn't sure what else to get I did pick up a couple more ornaments so my tree because I have three little well they're not all little anymore Aubrey's getting big she's like 14 but because I have children young children um, Lexi is only five right now and Kira is just turned 10 um, I like still doing kind of cute Disney themed ornaments and our tree my tree is full of handmade ornaments from my children as well so I don't have a very fancy tree I would call it more of like a family tree you guys know what I'm talking about probably the trees you grew up with that's how my tree is a lot of um, even ornaments from when Nathan and I were kids that our parents have given us like hand-me-down ones and a lot of this kind of stuff too and I don't mind it I just feel like there's a lot of memories with each ornament so I like that um, maybe when the kids get older I might do the pretty tree you know with all of the really fancy decorative ornaments but for now I like doing stuff like this Lexi was with me and she helped me pick out both of these so we have it looks almost like a bobblehead Minnie Mouse um, little ornament here and this was original price $17 but it was on sale and I think it was like on sale for I want to say $7.99 but with my rebates and stuff I paid $2 again for both of these um, and then this one here same thing it was $7.99 and then again together it was like two $2 so Yay for rewards. Okay, and then I have a bunch of stuff that I've picked up at TJ Maxx over the last few months. 
this candle you guys smells like Christmas this candle smells so good I first of all I love the um, the look of the candle itself it's this frosted red glass um, it's from the brand sand and fog and the scent is called winter pine and it literally smells like a Christmas tree it smells so good this was only $6.99 at TJ Maxx oh my gosh any products that I can find online I will link down below for you guys but Oh, I wish you could smell this. It literally smells like a fresh Christmas tree in my house, and I just feel like, yay, Christmas is coming. All right, and then this I found at TJ Maxx as well, and this, when I saw this, it just reminded me of Christie's style, and I was like, that's so pretty. I think my husband will hate it, but I freaking love it. It's this reindeer. I found out, by the way, since I've been doing this holiday shopping, I really like reindeers, because I think I've bought like five of them. But it's a reindeer, and it's covered in, like, sequins. So I'll give you guys a close up. I don't know how well it's going to show up on my camera, but it's so sparkly and so pretty. And this was only $7.99 at TJ Maxx. And I just think it's so glitz and glam and I freaking love it. This might end up in here somewhere. Ooh, that would be pretty in my background. Another home goods or no, another TJ Maxx item that I found is this super cute little um, box type of um, sign. And this one is from the brand Quill to Paper, and it just says Merry Christmas on it. It's very basic. It's basically just like that uh, distressed white color, and then inside is gray with the gold writing. Um, this is going to go in my bathroom right now. I have a, a something similar to this that says Give Thanks for Thanksgiving. As soon as Thanksgiving is over, I'm going to swap it out with this one. I needed something uh, about this size for Christmas, and it matches my downstairs. If you guys haven't seen, now we have um, gray faux wood floors that are very similar to this they're like vinyl floors but very similar to this color so gray and white is kind of my theme downstairs and then this one is actually from home goods I did find this tablecloth from Kate Spade um, my husband and I have um, a table downstairs in our dining room that we've had since we were like first married we've had it like 12 years and I hate it I just hate it so much but um, we can't afford to replace it so what I do instead is cover it up with tablecloths we've just had it so long and you know we've had little kids with it and it's gotten pretty beat up and there's lots of scratches and dents in it and it just looks old so I just get nice tablecloths to put over it this one is from Kate Spade it has really cute writing on it I don't know how well you guys will see that but there is uh, red on red so it's kind of difficult to see um, it just has like Christmas related words on here so it says like cheer brilliant dazzle pop season let it snow it's just like a bunch of holiday words um, randomly and I just think it's really cute and it, this was only $19.99 this I just thought was so pretty this I found at home goods as well and it basically looks like um, you know like a log or a piece of wood but it's got this really cool paint on it um, and then I don't know it's like textured too so it looks like there's snow on it um, I'll give you guys a close-up but it's actually plastic like when you first see it you're like oh my gosh that's a substantial like piece block of wood but it's not at all it's actually plastic um, and it's kind of kind of cheap faux candle but even though it's just basically a faux candle I just think it's so cute and it was only $7.99 again I'm just gonna put this on um, top of my fireplace I'm gonna have a whole escape of stuff so I think I'm gonna just gonna place this in there just to add a little bit of depth and a little bit of texture and then I did pick up just a little set of napkins also from home goods I just like the simple plaid that's on here it has a little bit of red in there because um, the tablecloth is red so I didn't want too much red I have a little uh, napkin can holder that goes on my table and um, so yeah I thought this would tie in with the tablecloth without going overboard another little reindeer that I found this one is also from home goods and this one was $9.99 um, this is very substantial it's very heavy and it's got kind of like that rose gold tone to it and I just think it's really really pretty I have lots of little tables and end tables and stuff downstairs for decor and I just I figured I could find a place for this and like I said I'm really into reindeers right now all right, next I got this basket. Now I've been wanting a basket like this. Let me see if I can get you guys in frame. It's pretty big, as you can see, and it has the cute little handles. It's very deep, but it's kind of a little bit um, narrow around in diameter. 
but the reason I wanted this, I've been seeing a lot of home decor videos girls using these to store their throw uh, blankets and stuff, and I really need something like that for our living room because my kids are always bringing extra blankets downstairs, and I just wanted a nice place where I could put them in that looks like decor, but it's also functional at the same time. So I was really excited to find this one, and this was, uh, by the way, this was only $12.99. It's a Tommy Bahama one. All right, more reindeers. This reindeer actually came from TJ Maxx as well. I had to have this when I saw it. It's just so cute. It's a matte white paint and then a matte gold paint on it. So um, it's just very different than everything else. It's very like shiny and glittery. I just thought this would look really cool kind of mixed in. Um, and it is wood, so it's very heavy and very nicely made. It was $16.99, so it's a little expensive, but it's very large. As you can see, it's a very large item. Um, and I just really fell in love with it. As soon as I saw it, I was like, yes, I definitely need to get that reindeer. Okay, and then I found a couple more candles at TJ Maxx. This one's from the brand DW Home. Now, the way that this is packaged, I think this would make a great gift. I'm not sure if I'm gonna gift it or if I'm gonna keep it yet, but I really like the way that it's packaged and the way it smells. This was only $7.99 and it's the brown sugar vanilla. Oh, you guys, it smells really, really good. And this is what the actual candle looks like. But it smells like brown sugar. It smells so, so good. And yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about that actually. But I really like the box, like I said, as well. And then this one also came with very fancy packaging. It's also from DW Home. I haven't really heard of this brand, but again, I'm not really a home decor junkie. I'm trying to get more into it. But if you guys know about this brand, let me know. It seems like a very fancy brand. And this, by the way, was uh, $9.99. It was a little bit more, but this one is vanilla bean bourbon. I'm definitely keeping this one because it smells incredible. But look how pretty that is, too. Like, it has this metal uh, label on the front. Like, I just think that's beautiful. And it smells um, amazing. But I think these make great gifts as well because of the boxes. Um, so if you see these at TJ Maxx, definitely pick them up. I think it's a great value. So yay. Okay, I'm making a big mess in here. Now the last couple things that I got are from Target. When I went to Target, I really didn't see a ton that I liked. But there were a few things and they were really good deals. So I'm excited that I was able to snag them. The first one is this really cute little Christmas tree. And this was only $3, you guys. It's a ceramic little Christmas tree. It's very basic. But again, I feel like when I mix it in with some of the other um, things that I picked up, it's just a solid white um, tree. I think it'll be really, really cute. And then I did pick up just this little frame from Target as well. It just has the full marble look on it. And it's just white and gray. And because I... Like I said, I'm doing the gray and white theme downstairs. I thought this would be perfect. I have an old frame that I've been wanting to replace because I just don't like the style of the frame anymore. And um, so I did pick this up. I feel like it was like $14.99. It was kind of expensive for a very basic frame, but I really just liked the way it looked, so I picked it up. And then the last thing, I don't even think this is really Christmas decor, but I saw this and it was on sale and I was like, that is so cute. So it's this cute little faux potted plant and the actual leaves are made of wood. They are carved wood and the color is such a vibrant green. I thought it would go in with the Christmas stuff really nicely, just like an add in item to some of the other colors, um, just to bring a little bit of the classic Christmas green in there. But this is something I could keep out year round. It doesn't have to be Christmas necessarily, but I just thought it was really cute. And I want to say it was on sale for like, I feel like it was like around $5, I want to say, but I just think it's really cute. So, all right, you guys. So that is everything I've picked up so far for this holiday season. I'm definitely going to be breaking out my Christmas decor soon. I think what I'm going to do, um, I haven't told you guys yet, but I am going to be doing Vlogmas this year or Vlogmas Vlogmas, I think is how you say it. I am going to be doing that this year. So I think I'm going to wait until December 1st to get out my Christmas decor so I can uh, do it with you guys on my vlog that day. Um, but I was just excited to pick up some new things. I feel like it's been a few years since I added any new Christmas decor to the decor that I already own. Part of the problem when you've been married as long as I am, I have, I, we've been married now for 15 years. Um, what ends up happening is that you you don't replace your stuff as frequently. You know what I mean? Like you get a full, so much Christmas decor and um, you just feel like you don't need anymore, but, you, but things get old and start to break or they just don't 
they're not the style anymore and so it's been nice kind of picking up a few new things here and there but if you guys want to let me know what your favorite item I picked up down below is that would be awesome and thank you guys so much for watching today I will see you in my next video bye guys